How long has this callus been a problem for you? Probably five years. Okay. And has it gotten deeper and deeper? It feels like it is, yes. Okay. Well, let's see if we can just make sure, first of all, that there's nothing else inside there, like a little foreign body or a piece of glass or a piece of animal hair or something like what? that. What? Yeah, that can happen. Are you kidding me? People mm -hmm. can actually get if it's a, a short over an animal hair? Yeah, if it's a short-haired animal oh uh, where the hair is God. very stiff, it just needs to be in just the right position, and if you step on it, it can go right into the skin. This could just be a little clogged sweat gland. What do you do then? Do? Well, what we could do is let me just trim it down, and we can, you know, if I don't see anything in there, um, then we can just put a little acid patch on it like I would do with a wart. Yeah. And that can bring, that can get at this little thick plug of skin a little deeper than I can do with my blade. I get it. So can people buy acid patches and just kind of work on it on their own? Well, you can, but you have to be careful because you don't want to go too deep because if you create a scar, then that's going to be more uncomfortable to walk on than what you started with. Okay, I won't so, be done. Yeah, so the problem with those is that people can go too deep. Okay. So I don't see any little sliver of glass or anything in there. Now, if I press right on it, is that better? Yes, because, yeah, okay. I mean, I could barely walk on it. Okay. So I don't think I'm going to be able to get much deeper without drawing blood. So what I think we should do is let's put the little patch on. And, um, and you just leave it on for 48 hours and keep it dry, and that'll get it a little bit deeper. So will the skin then just peel off? <laughs> it'll just, yeah. It'll so I just peel it off and, mm -hmm. okay. in, in 48 hours. And then, you know, and then maybe we'll have you back in a month and redo that if we have to. And the goal would be, like you had said before, that you came in and had this trimmed like once a month. And if, or once a year. And if that's what we have to do, then that's what we have to do. So all this like hard callousing stuff right here is It's it? just plain old callus. So, so that do you just can, leave that on there or do I aim to get it off or what? I'm gonna you you know, you could use on this which isn't really thick, it's more dry. I would say maybe use a pumice stone. You're gonna try the athlete's foot cream and see if some of this dry scaliness will go away. If maybe it's like that subclinical low grade athlete's foot. Maybe yeah. that will help. But for the part that's right in here, it's not very deep. And so I wouldn't go at it with a blade or one of those sanders or anything like that. I would just use a, a pumice stone, really, on this part. Okay. Right there. So. Okay, now, I have a bad memory. So <laughs> did you tell me to rub this athlete's foot cream all over my whole foot? I'll, I'll, I've got it all written down for you. Okay. Right, okay. Where you are. All right. Okay, so this is a cold spray here. First, I put on a little patch of mole skin that will hold the acid right where I want it. Then there is a liquid acid and then a different acid in a paste form that I apply. And then a little bit of cotton to hold it all in and then an outer bandage to put everything in place. So after 48 hours, am I taking it off and then just peeling whatever skin will come off? And that's exactly what she'll do.